Okay, my brothers, today we are going to destroy the United States of America. We are going to make my dream real. Oh, wait a minute. I didn't want to say that. I wanted to say that today we are going to play as the independent Texas and the Kaiser Redux. And today we are going to bring a Giga Chat to the power in the Texas. We are going to bring Wilhelm II as the new Kaiser of the Texas, who is going to reunify the whole United States of America under the Kaiser's control. So, enjoy! And as always when we play America. God save America. Fuck this coalition of Democratic and Republican Party, cause Democratic Party wants to ban Donald Trump. I do not support it. So a coalition would debase the democratic system. And of course Black Monday hits America. Why not the White Sunday, I don't know, but this is just not our year. And as always now we have pig that crashed in the two halves and the pig that crashed in a lot of pieces. That's catastrophic, that's okay. Dude, they are almost the same, just look at this. Duma and same. The same. Now we have the scene that is going to change the whole geopolitical situation. Icelandic independence. How might this affect the Atlantic? And do not worry, brothers, I didn't forget about the sounds. You are going to hear them in a few minutes. <laughs> you are going to hear them in a few minutes. Okay, so now we can see the horrors of the socialism in the Russia. They have made up the revolution. And Zhukov isn't bold. Okay, now we have the independent Crimea and also West Russian army. Belarus has sized the Russian territories. It seems to be pretty interesting Russian civil war. And it's going to be to the American civil war. Two civil wars in the great countries. In one campaign. It's very interesting, you know. And what about Ukraine? They sized Belgorod and part of the Kursk Oblast. What about the present elections? Let's just elect the William Murray. Why not? Well, support for Texan independence grows. It's worrying. America has started to crash, but now we have the an illegal referendum in the Texas about their independence. And right now we are in no position to stop them. So Texas leaves the USA. And now when Texas has left the USA, we are going to play as the Texas. And with that we have the counter-revolution in the Britain with authoritarian democrats. So Union of Britain has been destroyed. And now we have the United Kingdom and probably Antente will come back to the United Kingdom. Fuck, Mexico has sized El Paso. And yep, the United Kingdom has restored and it's now under Entente control. Call in! Hey, sir! Call in! Call in! Commands! Call in! Oh, what about our population? Now in the whole Texas we have almost 6 million people live in this based American state. But now we are not the American state, we are just the Republic of Texas. And what about uh, Texaco influence? We must to make it higher and higher. The good thing is that the old faction accepted the Texan independence. Now they will just deal with their own and won't touch us. That's good. Uh, I haven't seen that before. Now we have the Missouri Democratic Organization. Where the fuck is he long and why did you change your color? And now their capital is located in the Kansas City. Not in the New Orleans. And of course Texas choose Germany. Germany and Texas have had ties going back centuries, so a line with the Kaiser is a logical conclusion. 
Texas and Germany will stand together against syndicalist hordes and the horrors of the socialism. And about the Texans and the German sphere, we request full entry into the Reichspact. And while we are ensuring the embrace with German ties, let's uh, move against the government. The president must be replaced. Goodbye, James. And let's request the full entry into the Reichspact. And yes, Germans have accepted us into the Reichspact. Well done, my brothers. Now, Republic of Texas is in the Reichspact. So, finally, goodbye, James. And yeah, now we have the National Committee of State. We have even event about it that the Texaco sizes the state of Texas. They are a nation ruled by the shadows and corruption. Just look at this encirclement. It's amazing. Now my strategy is just to search this good focus tree that's going to boost my economy, cause my economy has collapsed. I still didn't get why is this dude smiling and he has a heart on his flag. He's strange, not a little bit, quite a big. So now our government has failed up and the military backs Andrew Jackson Houston as the president. Hmm, that's a good man. He has cool mustache and a cool view. And now our goal is to reach the free elections and we are going to elect that man that we need. And yeah, our focus tree is just a giant for the small state. Well, we searched the free election and we got a monarchist idea. And of course we are going to choose a king. So Andrew Jackson is going to become a king of the whole Texas. Now the schizophrenia is rising up. Oh yeah. Now we are the kingdom of Texas. We have changed our flag for the second time. And now Andrew the first is ruling the Texas. And after that we are moving to this focus tree and this focus tree is going to be the final focus tree of our politician. Race of the Schizophrenic Kingdom. Yeah, like from the beginning of the our campaign, we are only getting the debuffs. And that's all. At least now you can see that we got some buffs. And the second American Civil War is cringe. And I don't know who is going to win because the whole situation is crazy. Because someone has peace with each other, someone came back like the Constitutional American Republic, someone has enough military factories and civil factories as combined syndicates of America, and someone is just like a United States of America. Well, now we have minus Deutsches Mittel Africa. So, Entente has restored their full control under the African colonies. Welcome back, Bruder Eisenhower, who returns home. You are always welcome here. He is going to be our new field marshal. A tragedy has happened with our King Andrew the First, and after this tragedy, he is dead. And we again have the Texas Regency. So about the Regency. In solidarity with our German allies and German brothers, the Kaiser Wilhelm II is chosen as our new king of Kingdom of Texas. A Kaiser for Texas. Langlebe der Kaiser. Now we are the Texanisches Kaiserreich. So we have established Kaiserreich in the Kaiser Redux. Funny situation, you know. And also we have changed our flag to the German one. And now Wilhelm II with the funny head now is ruling the Texanish Kaiser Reich. And he is going to make a Texas great again. He is going to reunify the whole post United States. Hey bro, nice cock. So like with this focus tree we make up the mix of the Texas and the Deutsches Kaiser Reich. Cause we adopt the best things from the Deutsches Kaiser Reich to our own. 
Well, 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 the Kingdom of Finland declared war on the Russian Socialist Republic and that means that they are going to start war against the Rex Pact. It's not good for them. The Russian Civil War is gonna be endless. Oh, and also the Kingdom of France declared war on the German Empire to the our Dutch's brothers. Now we have our own problems and also we need to destroy that United Stupid Mexican States in the future, in a few months, probably in 1940, we are going to destroy them. And after that, we are going to destroy other sides of the American Civil War. And now with the based Kaiser, with the based GigaChat leader of the Texas, we have 100% stability and 100% of the war support. It's all happening cause the Kaiser Wilhelm II is ruling our country. He is going to make Texas as great as the German Empire or the Deutsches Kaiserreich. Hola gringo. Hola Mexico. Watch your ass, stupid Mexican states. It's almost the year 1940 and still no one has capitulated in the American Civil War. It's kinda interesting situation. Goodbye. We're going to destroy Mexico pretty easily. Well, the good thing is that the big part of the Mexico now is under our control and soon we are going to capture the Mexico City and capitulate them. Hello Mexico City, we are going to capture you in a few days. And as I said, we did it. Now we are going to the southern parts of the Mexico. So Mexico has capitulated, we are taking all of their states and going to release the based Mexico under our control. Yep, the small Texas has captured a big Mexico. And now we got the new United States of the Mexico. But as our puppet. And our next new goal is going to be uh, Missouri Democratic Organization. Uh, why not? So the fraction of the Missouri Democratic Organization is too strong, as you can see, because they have almost capitulated the combined syndicates of America and the Constitutional American Republic. So now we have to declare war on them and make the Civil War pretty balanced. So let's have a fun and capture Kansas City. Now Texas is getting bigger and bigger. So by the end of the November 1940, my front line looks like this. It's not so bad, I can say. And yeah, New Orleans has fall cause of their stupidness. Well, we have captured their capital, Kansas City. Why the hell they moved their capital into Chicago? Okay, let it be. Well, goodbye Missouri Democratic Organization, cause in a few months they are going to capitulate, probably near the summer, I don't know. But now I'm just making fun with them. It's pretty easy to destroy them. And yet yeah, they have capitulated and I'm going to divide them with the combined syndicates. Okay, they took some states that I took, so this is not fair. I'll make fair partition. Like I gave them the few states, but they didn't deserve for the states they took, really. I gave them Southern Illinois and a few more states, like Kentucky Fried Chicken, and that's enough for them, cause they have almost capitulated. Well, I would like to make an exchange for Rio Grande, I'll give them Utah. I think it's fair. It's even like unfair, cause they give me just the Rio Grande, and I gave them Utah. Well, I just needed to restore the border of 1848. Okay, I'll make exchange with them for the Northern Missouri and Missouri, for the North Carolinian coast, cause I need them to make the confederate states. Now the border looks like this, and yeah, much more better, Kaiserreich der Schutzstatler. And I like that square border, just look at this, it's a real square. Oh, and we gotcha a new flag, and all of these territories must be core states. And in the future we are going to form the United States of the Western America. For that we need to capture the Pacific States. Okay, so now probably we are going to have war not with the Pacific States, but with the combined syndicates of America. And I don't know how did they get the Western Montana. 
Let's give it back to the Pacific states, cause it's not logical, you know. And well, their army is small, so I think that we can easily defeat. So I think that we can easily defeat stupid communards in Chicago. Okay, so basically Wilhelm II, our based Kaiser, now is dead. But now we have new based Kaiser with a new funny hat and a funny costume. Wilhelm III, a new king of the Kaiserreich der Südstadtler. Well, if syndicalists hadn't start war against me, I'll start war against them. Let's destroy fucking communards. Oops, it's only September and we have captured Washington DC. Oops. Thank you so much for not defending Philadelphia. And now you shouldn't defend New York City. Thank you for being stupid, CSA. Now New York is going to be liberated in the end of the September 1941. New York is ours under Kaiser's control. Capturing CCA be like too easy goal. Okay, so game thinks now that the PC has won the Civil War, they had the super event of the end of American Civil War and their victory. But no, we won't rejoin America. Fuck you, Leatherman. That's my answer on your question. Now America is gonna be reunified. Once and forever. with the Kaiser's firm hand. And as I said, it's gonna be pretty easy. Cause in a few days we are going to capture Los Angeles, after that we are moving to the San Francisco and Sacramento. And that's all, they have capitulated after that. It's really too easy, just no one is defending San Francisco and no one is going to defend Sacramento. Oh wait, someone is defending, but he won't handle. As I said, Sacramento is going to be captured pretty easily. Now let's go probably, yep, to the Seattle. We are moving to the Seattle. It's like all that has left from the Pacific States of America. And soon they are going to capitulate. Okay, and Russia have started war with the whole China. Cause they are in the one alliance. Yeah baby, we have reunified the whole America. Now let's proclaim the Western America in the three days. Okay, so it's Kingdom of Texas with the flag of the Greece. And so that's all for today, cause now we can't proclaim anymore. But still, Antente is our brothers, so we are not in the war with them and we won't have any conflicts. We will left New England with them, we don't need it. Cause just look at the great Texas, look at the great Kingdom of the Texas. Now our population is almost 130 million people. Also we have a Mexico as our puppet and just look at the Rex Pact sphere of influence. And of course our brother Wilhelm the Sword who has reunified those taxes. So yeah my brothers, thanks for watching and bye.